Hey there Aquarius, it's Adria Z, also known as the sweetest spiritual gangsta. I'm back with another message of love. This is for you and your person and what they want to say to you, what's on their thoughts about you. If this resonates, definitely like, share, and subscribe. If it doesn't, check out your sun, moon, or rising sign, okay, um, to see if that resonates. Or also check out another YouTuber, you know, sometimes every message is not going to resonate. Um, but yeah, this is going to be for uh, September 9th until the 11th, okay? We're going to start off with some warnings and then we're going to go to see what your person actually wants to say to you, okay? So let's get some warnings. Hold on, let me push this down a little bit. All right, let's get some warnings, please, spirit guides. Let's get some warnings. For all of my Aquarians all around the world, show me what we need to see for all of my Aquarians all around the world regarding their lover what is going on for Aquarius and their lover what is going on for some warnings what should they be warned about with Aquarius and their lover show me two more okay so let's get into it we do have woman dealings or relationship with a woman so this could be about you this could be about maybe someone that you are dealing with okay show me what else we do have great happiness okay coming in what else do we have we have pay attention to your health Aquarius okay so this could be an Aquarius woman that needs to pay attention to her health or masculine energy but definitely pay attention to it keep up with your vitamins keep drinking water work out a little bit eat, eat some greens okay eat something that will help your body okay we also have climbing towards success okay so you are definitely either climbing towards success regarding work okay or this connection but I feel like it's more so work again take care enemies are working against you so i feel like you're going to be very happy within your energy aquarius but i feel like there are people that are kind of either peeking their eye out at you kind of got like you know a look on their face like watching you and shit okay show me what else we do have success assured with good plans and hard work again i feel like you are trying to manifest something into your reality regarding just your work okay and everything that you're doing okay the, the the trash is being taken out right now as well so i don't know if you gotta throw the trash out okay um if you hear that that sound that noise right now but something about you know either maybe fake friends around you i don't know let's see what else yeah tricky someone is behaving stupidly yeah someone in your life is still trash okay someone is not really doing as much not to call people trash but yeah someone is not as beneficial to your life as you think they are okay we have new job or career yeah so i feel like um someone is a hater in your energy i feel aquarius you're coming into really what you need to be okay and there's someone on the outskirts that are a little salty about this happiness that you are having so be aware of people kind of trying to um prey on your downfall i guess you could say okay overall energy we do have something important such as a new job or a race so you're definitely coming into some good money and shit like that okay but i do feel like there's going to be some temporary problems that do occur so be aware of that show me what we need to see for some um energy coming inward what is coming in towards all of my aquarians what is coming in towards all of my aquarians what is coming in towards all of my aquarians what is coming in towards all of my aquarians we have spiritual strength okay so something about your spirituality something about um you being your higher self is very important right now you need to lift yourself up out of any problems if people try to shut the door on you you have to have strength right now you it's not about your anger it's not about your feelings you need to have spiritual strength okay you need to pray on god okay um i feel like pray for yourself but I feel like overall, you're definitely going to be seeing some things in this in certain situations where you see truths, okay? Wow, truths, okay? I just feel like it might hurt though, some of these truths, okay? And that's why you do need to stay in your higher and lighter self. Don't lower yourself at all. Disruption, I'm telling you. Something is disrupting your energy regarding this person. It could happen on the 16th of this month and 16 days, possibly 16 weeks or maybe 9 days, okay? Show me what else yeah light i'm telling you be your lighter self i feel like you are coming into what you need to but i do feel like someone or something is trying to disrupt that something someone's trying to i feel like fuck up what you're trying to birth for yourself okay a very br br brand new beginning i feel like is coming in for you and someone's trying to ruin that again material and spiritual prosperity okay overall we do have conflict and defeat what did i say 
throat chakra or someone got to speak up or you're going to have to speak up towards someone or something, okay? We do have memories of love as well. So again, like I said, this could be a lover or this could be someone that is salty about you moving past certain things. Someone is in love with the old you still, okay? Or they want you to be the old you, but you are triumphing past that. And I feel like this person you might have to cut out, all right? But let's get into it. Let's see what this person wants to say to you. For all of my Aquarians, what does Aquarius' this person want to say to them? I'm single and ready to mingle. Oh, okay. Okay. Show me what else is Aquarius' this person wanting to say to Aquarius. Foodie. Okay, so this person could love food. They could eat a lot. <laughs> Show me what else does this person want to say to Aquarius. She needs to stay in the past if I'm in your present. Okay, so this person, I feel like they try to act as if they either don't care that you're trying to date other people or I feel like they try to they try to come off as if oh well I'm gonna go find someone better if you're gonna act like this okay I feel like this person likes to make you jealous okay they like to be like oh someone else will take me out for food maybe they love food they love to eat okay we also have teas okay so you could be dealing with the Gemini Gemini had this energy Aquarius show me what else is going on for all of my Aquarians okay it's not you it's me mm -hmm. yeah so i do feel like there's someone that they are insecure about that it lingers in your energy aquarius okay show me what else is going on feeling too emotional right this person is really just trying to like get a rise out of you i feel um aquarius someone is like kind of petty i'm getting a petty energy show me what else is going on this person moves more with their heart instead of like thinking before their actions I worry that there's someone else. Wow. Mm -hmm. So this person worries that there's someone else. So then they try to act like they got someone else. That they're going to go find someone new. Show me what else is going on. Still not over you. Right. This person tries to act like they're not caring. They're only doing their own thing, Aquarius. But they care. <laughs> they care. Show me what else. We have win. Yeah. So they do feel like you are a win. They feel like you are a trophy. Okay. I feel like they do want, they don't want, they don't really want anyone else but you. But I feel like they want you to either cut someone off, either if it's a masculine or a feminine energy. They, they want you to get rid of anyone else. Okay, because they're going to act like they're still doing them, but really they want to know that there's no one else coming into this energy. Give me my space, I'll come to you. So exactly, yeah, this person's also being very um, kind of flighty or they're just very inconsistent with their communication with you. You're seeing that there's a shift, obviously. Right, I don't feel like we work, we go well together. Mm -hmm. So maybe there's certain differences that you guys haven't came across. Maybe also, maybe it comes when it comes to relationships, either it's been a situationship that you've been dealing with, or maybe this is just some, maybe I feel like there is just something that doesn't let the connection mesh as well as it should. It's not flowing as easily, okay? I feel bad how I treated you. So this person does feel bad, again, being very inconsistent, saying one thing, doing another. Again, sacral chakra, pleasure chakra. Uh, this is the uh, second chakra, well-being, sexuality. Problems is infertility, hip pain, emotional imbalances, and creativity blocked. So this person's also very... Um, their whole sex vibe okay um, because the sacral chakra is their genitalia i feel like this person also uses sex as um, a purpose of feeling okay or, or i feel like being or feeling seen so i do feel like they are kind of trying to step out to try to find someone else to fulfill maybe you not being able to be around or you giving them their space or them saying one thing then doing another you're giving them their space but then they're salty that you could be with someone else i just feel like also this person's not focused on I feel like they're money the way they should be, whether it's you or them, right? I don't want to wait any longer. Be mine, right? This person is just all over the place. I feel like they're salty that you do maybe, <laughs> right, horny. Okay, let's get into it. Let's get some more cards. Let's get some more cards. Let's get three cards, please. Yeah, healing family issues, your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. So I do feel like maybe between both you and your person, there is some forgiving about um, maybe love that you either saw or received from, um, you know, your parents or the love you've experienced yourself. There's something about healing um, certain maybe um, 
childhood traumas. There's something that needs to be brought about with the issues that you do have regarding love, okay? I feel um, that is something that's going to be very, very heightened. I feel like you guys need to know that it's safe for you to be vulnerable in this dynamic. There's something that is, there's something or someone, either or, that is not letting each other be vulnerable, okay? unrequited love right there's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this going again like i said it only goes so far and it's because of some reason okay it's because either this person's not opening up you guys both are on the same level okay maybe this is just based off of attraction there's not enough chemistry there's not enough like oh let's go do this i don't like the same foods as you i just feel like there's like a, a differences that are actually affecting this sorry some cards fell let me grab them so okay we do have getting to know each other so yeah i do feel like there is a sense of maybe you guys needing to get to know each other more because again like i said it's all it's only based off of attraction something is just physical it's not mental someone doesn't feel connected okay overall energy let your friends help you mm -hmm, this could be the one so i do feel like maybe this person should get some outside advice um i feel like you guys should kind of come on a common ground if you can let's get some rude advice what do you need to hear fuck fear right okay it will lie to your face let's see this person's next moves let's see this person's next moves they are coming in with an apology something very small it's not going to be too big or too crazy but they do want to get past um where the state of the connection is i feel like someone's getting bored of what's going on right now okay i feel like they're also getting upset right they're wanting to bring you something that's actually very nice okay they're bringing some type of proposal in they're wanting to birth this connection right with the world card as i split the deck could be a scorpio an aquarius like yourself or a leo or a taurus that you're dealing with show me one more yeah, this person's this person wants to start a new dream. You could definitely be dealing with the Gemini, okay? But yeah, this person's definitely turning the wheel on something. If something is gonna turn into your favor, but this person still lets their mental blockages ruin this, okay? So they might be still trying to manipulate a, situ a certain situation to go the way it, it should, more so in their favor. So be aware of that, okay? Yeah, this could be an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, but as I split the deck there, we did have lovers, okay? This person's still gonna fight for you, but they are still in player mode. Again, I'm ready to single, uh, or I'm single ready to mingle, yeah. But they are wanting to invest in this, but they're still in that player energy, okay? So that's all I'm saying. Yeah, so I feel like just don't get your hopes up because this person's still dwelling on some of the things in the past that you guys do need to get past, like we were saying. Let's get one uh, card of advice. Within the next few months, let's see one more, take action. So within the next few months, take action towards this person. Let's get one word for you to remember, and that was your reading. All right, nothing, okay? Spirit ain't got nothing else to say to you, okay? Uh, but that was your, let's take this one, because it wants to peek out. We have tenderness. Ooh, so I feel like definitely be maybe more tender with this person, but I feel like there's not much else to say, but you need to become more softer or there's there's a softness that needs to come back into this connection because it's very hard, okay? But that was for you. I hope it helps in some way, Aquarius. I'll be back with another message very soon. Um, stay safe, stay happy, and also make sure you comment, like, subscribe. Let me know how this does resonate for you. But yeah, I'll be back with another message very soon.